It was a frightening and deadly attack in Brooklyn's Prospect Park. A woman out walking with her dog jumped and beaten from behind. She survived, but her dog did not. Eyewitness News reporter Josh Einiger speaking with that woman tonight about the attack and her calls for justice. It's every bit the People's Park, Prospect Park. 500 acres of heaven in the middle of Brooklyn, loaded with cyclists and families and dog walkers. My heart is shattered. I'm shattered. My world is shattered. My dog was my world. People like Jessica, who's too rattled to show her face or use her last name. After all, she just buried her best friend, Moose, after a run-in the two of them had with an emotionally disturbed homeless man right here. This is a violent individual who um, needs more than just um, an intervention of being taken out of the park. They need to be charged because they have violent tendencies. It happened around dawn last Wednesday as Jessica was walking her two and a half year old golden retriever mix near the picnic house on the park's west side. She says the man who was muttering about immigration sprayed her with urine. That's when she decided she had to get away. So she and the dog went right back up the steps toward home. But by the time they got to the top, the man had caught up and attacked. We got up the staircase. He had hit me in the back and then he hit Moose across the face so hard that it shattered one of his teeth and he also apparently hit him on the side. Moose needed not one but two surgeries when the vet discovered he was suffering a perforated intestine. He died on the table. I want justice for my dog and I want people to be safe and feel safe in the park. No one should feel unsafe in the park. The NYPD's Animal Cruelty Unit is investigating, as is the local detective squad. Jessica hopes they make an arrest soon after this appalling case of random violence in the People's Park. In